Hello, Jess Too Good here, and we have our first LEGO Marvel 2022 set pictures. These were from LEGO.com, and I have to thank Michael Brooks and Falcon Fan for notifying me. The first of which is a new Iron Man mech armor set. And these will be $10 like always. This one has 130 pieces, and this design is different enough from the 2020 Iron Man mech armor set, but it feels like it's so close to a remake of that set that this is unnecessary. However, I will say I like the new Iron Man minifigure where you have this interesting comic look. They still use that invincible Iron Man helmet, but at least this is with a different expression there. The gold and red work well on the minifigure and it works well on the mech. I also like that piece they use for the shield. I will say Iron Man mechs make the most sense out of all these mechs because when you get to somebody like Wolverine's, why the heck does Wolverine have a mech? This doesn't make sense. There's no point here. But the design of the Wolverine mech set at least has a cool color scheme. It looks like an extension of Wolverine's body in one way, so it doesn't look awful. But still, again, I don't know why Wolverine would need a mech. The design of Wolverine is a new figure for 2022. It's absolutely awesome to get new X-Men minifigures. The last time we got a new X-Men minifigure besides this set was a Mighty Micro set. Either way, this mech has 141 pieces. I like how they're using that comic X-Men logo there, and getting that chassis piece in yellow will be pretty nice. I'm kind of sad that they don't have an alternate hair piece for Wolverine. I guess the face print underneath just wouldn't fit for an unmasked version of Wolverine. But judging how the logo just says Wolverine and not X-Men, how the Avengers sets will say Avengers, I don't think we're going to get much more X-Men sets anytime soon but only one of these mech sets has an unmasked version of the character, which is the Black Panther mech. This one also doesn't make sense, like why is Black Panther using mech armor? But there is like a comic series ongoing that ties into this mech armor stuff, so maybe that's what they're going for here. At the end of the day, I will say out of all of them, the Black Panther mech actually looks the coolest. Just that black and purple color scheme and those big claws work really well with this design. And the minifigure included is a new Black Panther figure with a T'Challa face print. That's something that I've wanted for so long. I mean, we got it with Star-Lord, but that's about it. So that's really nice to get in this cheap set. Looks like the torso print is new as well. All right, guys, when I was done editing and uh, uploading an original version of this without this new set, what the fudge? This looks awful. <laughs> the buildable Iron Man looks really, really bad. I was expecting something like Arishim, but this scale just makes it look very dumpy and just short stack in a way. Ugh, those proportions. I'm not sure this was the best execution of what they could have done here. I guess that's what you get for keeping it at 40 bucks. Oof. Now let me know your favorites in the comments below. Subscribe for more LEGO news and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, bye.